What's the deal with YouTube? It's your boy Next Gen 720, and I'm back with another video. And ladies and gentlemen, you guys have been rocking out with your boy from my old channel. You know what I mean? I started my first Facebook Facebook group. I'm excited. I got about I don't know 100 some odd members now. I just linked it yesterday. Uh, my name of my group is Bang Bang Next Gen Gamers. You know what I mean? All is welcome. All we ask you to do is. Keep it next gen. I don't give a what you play on. The Atari Jaguar, the 3DS. I don't care. You will not be bad on your choice of preference of a console. It's true, you know what I mean? Y'all ask you respect other people's opinion. Everybody's not going to like your console of choice. You know what I mean? Whatever you choose, I'll ask you to keep it next gen, you know what I mean? That's all, you know what I mean? And like before I start today's video, a lot of you guys, especially in the Wii U Mad, you know, Facebook. I post my videos and people, like I said, I don't mind if you don't like whatever I post or whatever. But when you look, and when you say things about me personally and you wonder why I'm talking about I want to have anal sex with your grandma, don't be surprised about that. You know what I mean? So it is what it is. It's not once you say I don't like your video or just whatever, and I come back and I say anything about you personally or you know what I mean. I don't do that. You know what I mean? But if you will say something, you know, if you insult me, I will insult you back. You know what I mean? That's real shit, but you know, but at the end of the day, I'm, I'm trying to learn to turn the other cheek, but I have a new Facebook group, it's called Bang Bang Next Gen Gamers, you know what I mean, just like my, you know, my YouTube name, Next Gen, Next Gen Together Gamers, Bang Bang Next Gen Gamers, I will leave a link in the description, enough with all that, early, like I said, my allergies was killing me, I just came back from the hospital, uh, I got some, some good stuff uh, for allergies, my daughter's eye, come here, boo-boo. Her eye, when she got up, was like this. Come here, boo-boo. Come show, come show the world. Look at my boo-boo. Boo -boo. She got allergies, too. This is real in the Johnson household. Look at that. Like somebody, maybe like somebody didn't, like she didn't have a fight with smoking Joe Frazier, man. You know? All right, boo-boo. Oh, man. <laughs> okay, go watch, go watch Caillou. She ate french fry. Okay. You know what I mean? So, like I said, so, got some medicine. Actually, it's looking a lot better as going down. But anyway, enough of my rules. Um, there's a lot of, of things that I want to talk about in this video here. Um, good, good and great news. Forza 5, any Forza fans out there, me, myself, personally, I don't care for Forza. But Forza 5 will be 1080p at 60 frames per second. Uh, Turn 10 Studios has come out and announced that the game will be running at 1080p at, you know, 60 frames per second. Um, also, there's a rumor floating around that DICE is, uh, that... Uh, Battlefield 4 and you know on the 720 sorry 720 on the Xbox one and the PlayStation 4 will also be uh, 1080p uh, 60 frames per second that's a rumor you know what I mean <laughs> so we should see also uh, like I said, a lot I want to talk about NBA 2k14 is skipping the Wii U this is you know like I said before and, and I'm not trolling I'm not bashing this is real shit here like I tell Sometimes, you Nintendo fans, you guys have to support your system. Developers are in the business to make money. They're not going to put games on your platform and nobody goes out and buy them. You know, NBA 2K13 sold like 12,000 copies worldwide. It's like I say, you know, they're not going to, not just, you know, not even say 2K. I bought a copy because I'm a, I'm a 2K fan, but, you know, you're not, you guys are not going to get a lot of these games if you don't start going out and supporting your, your console and, you know, and you know, and support these games. You know, what I mean, for whatever reason, I, I I don't know. You're not buying these games, but um, it is what it is. So 2K14, but it will launch day one on the Xbox One and the PlayStation 4 and PC and Xbox 360 and the PlayStation 3. This will not be coming to the Wii U. Now, with that, we said there's been much said, much hoopla about Microsoft online policies as far as they use games and yada 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 yada. Even I'm gonna take one thing at a, at, at a time. Uh, Microsoft decided they're not going to do any one-on-one any one -on -one interviews after the E3. They said they're going to come kick the fucking door down, throw their shirt for Rick James, bitches, and, you know, and, and then step off, you know what I mean? Um, I guess they didn't like all that ambush, ambush journalism they received about, you know, the Xbox One. And I was, you know, and I guess they felt kind of salty about that, you know what I mean, for whatever reason. I don't know. So they're not granting any one-on-one -on -one interviews. I mean, myself personally, I think this is a mistake. You know, explain to more about what your console can do. You know what I mean? I'm all, I mean, I get it because I'm an Xbox you know, fan. I, I, me, I like the features. I can say, I can see me now. I'm going to have about, you know, how many launch games I'm going to get. But to say if I have 10 launch games, I can say, 
Um, Battlefield 4. <clears throat> NBA 2K14. Madden, two, Madden, uh, Madden, two, Madden 14. You know what I mean? Just go by me talking to my console, automatically switching games. Like, I think that is yeah, that, that, that dope shit. You know what I mean? That's just me. You know what I mean? But even before us, I think they're, they should, you know, you know, it is what it is. People are going to have shit to say regardless. It is what it is. Like, I remember when Xbox Live came out in 2002 and Microsoft had to drag everybody by their hair into the new generation as far as broadband game. If you remember, Xbox Live, you had to have a broadband connection. And broadband back in 2002 was, now everyone had it, you know what I mean? <clears throat> Not everybody had it. But look at now, you know what I mean? Because I remember you could play online on the PlayStation 2 with AOL and, you know, dial up. But when it came to the Xbox Live market, you had to have a broadband connection. Now it's the norm, you know what I mean? So maybe it, it might hit pay dirt with this shit right here, what they're trying to do. I don't know. Like I said, I got it. They, they're, they're pulling a, a ballsy move, you know what I mean? Their explanation as far as them, not saying that I agree with it, but as far as that you, you have to have a connection at least once a day for every 24 hours, is saying that their console is built to be powered by the cloud. Everything's connected and you can always have access to your stuff. That's their, what they're saying, you know what I mean? Do I agree with it? No, I, I don't. You know what I mean? I, I get it. You know what I mean? I, trust me. I mean, I, I've in fact been with the whole DRM thing. You know, and trust me. You know, everybody's you know on Microsoft back about this. Sony's gonna be the same goddamn way. You know, I can see EA now saying that hey, Sony, you're not looking out for our best interests. You know, but we're gonna stick with Microsoft because they have something in place. So that Sony has something in place as far as to block you, not to say block them or restrict them. Like to you know mandate them or no, monitor them, whatever the case may be. I believe Sony's thing is going to go that you can open open this game. Uh, what the hell is this? Get on Live Five. When you open it, you're going to have a code. You have to put that code in and let you know that the game is new. Now, if you don't have that code, I believe that Sony or whatever they're going to charge you a fee, whether it be fifteen off, whatever the goddamn case may be, they're going to charge you a fee for it. You know, it is what it is. So even like I say, even <clears throat> about you know Microsoft requiring a an internet connection. Just think about the people that don't have the internet in North America. Now, I'm going to say what can. It's 2013, 2014. If you don't have the internet connection, what the fuck are you doing with an Xbox One or a PlayStation 4? You know what I mean? Oh, if, you, if you're looking at my video right now, guess what, ladies and gentlemen? You all have the internet. You know what I mean? I get it. You know what I mean? And that aspect is, are we just complaining for the sake of complaining? You know, Hard Eight did a video saying, um, you know, what the hell he said, you know, that, you know, if my internet goes out, I'm the table joke, if the internet out, I ain't playing no goddamn games anyway. I'm like, you know what I mean, because I like connecting, I like talking, I'm, you know, I like, you know, that's just me. And then I know what I eat don't make, you know, make you guys shit, whatever the case may be, but it is what it is. Now, say if, like I said, Sony has something like that in place also, I believe, listen, listen to the keywords Sony said, they said it's not going to be up to them. All right, I gotta get you some juice. juice all right, he said it's not gonna be up to them. What I say yesterday? No. Okay. They said it's not gonna be up to them. It's gonna be up to the developers. And what developers don't want more money? Come on. It is what it is. EA Online Pass. You know what I mean? It is what it is. Oh, it's a little girl. Maya, stop it. Stop. Stop. What's wrong? Nothing to say. Stop. Wait. No. Anyway, um, you know, so far as. Okay, look, you done fell. Woo, I didn't touch him. <laughs> um, anyway. Okay, sit down. Look, you see, probably think I done beat punch you in your face. Bad as you is. This little girl left the hook, man. Um, are you serious? Stop. Um, so, like I said, you know, uh, like, say if you buy a new game from PlayStation, from Sony, the PlayStation 4, and you have to input that code, and you don't have the internet, you're not going to be able to play that game. You know what I mean? That's my little man calling me right there. I'm almost done with this video. You're not going to be able to play that game, so I, I, I think it's a ballsy move. You know what I mean? I think it's a ballsy move. You know what I mean? But we're going to see if it hit pay. Put it down. We're going to see if it hit pay dirt. You know what I mean? We're going to see if it, you know, it pans out for him. You know what I mean? I don't think they should do it like that. You know what I mean? Not just yet, but hey, it is what it is. Am I getting one day one? Hell yeah. I'm excited. I can't wait, you know what I mean? I, I love getting new consoles, man. You know, I, that's just me. I'm, I'm always got something day one. I think in the history of me gaming, I may have got uh, the Virtual Boy and the Atari Jaguar, or something like that. Everything else I've had since day one, Neo Geo. I had a Neo Geo, ladies and gentlemen. 
the totals was 200 bucks, you know what I mean? The Neo Geo, motherfucking Turbo Graphics 16, like, I, you know, I've always had consoles, like me. But anyway, I'm about to wrap this video up. What do you guys think? Before, I'm going to edit say in the comment section. What do you guys think about uh, Forza 5 being 1080p 60 frames per second? That's one thing. Like I said, you know, if you're going from consoles, and I guess if you never played on the PC before, you, you really don't know what it is. Like I said, that's like a hot knife of butter. That's dope shit, you know what I mean? Um, like I said, um, you know, what do you guys how you feel about that? You know what I mean? 1080p, 60 frames per second, Forza, Forza 5, you know what I mean? Dude, what do you think about the always online? No, not always, but at least once a day. To me personally, it's not a problem. I even have 4G on my phone. I, you know, use it as a what you call it, like, you know what I mean? Actually, there, well, there's a will, there's a way. I have a friend of mine right now that plays Xbox Live on his Verizon phone. He has a limited hotspot. So do I, you know what I mean? But I'm just saying, though, you know what I mean? It is what it is. I, I, I don't think my... If you think that I'm damage control for them, read my lips. I do not think that they should have done it that way. You know what I mean? Now, as far as the used games, well, you know what I mean? You, you're not charging you a fee, but I do feel that these developers should get, you know, a piece of the pie. You know, the GameStop should... You know, get pony up some of that cash. Like, I don't care for games not practices. You know what I mean? That's my take on that. You know what I mean? So uh, it is what it is. And also, 2K14 not coming to the Wii U. And as I always say, bang, bang. <laughs> What's my legs too? Allergies was killing me, son. Oh.